Starting, motherfuckers. Maybe I'm losing my mind. You see, just a couple of months ago, life was good. Life was normal. The sun shone and everything was peachy. But today, nowadays, it's like something's taken over my life. This evil, unseeable thing moved into my house and it's turning my life upside down. That's why I think these awful creatures with the misleadingly cute name, the nasty, antisocial, totally gross bed bug, they're gonna be the death of me and they're gonna be the death of us all. The vermin came in and started procreating like there was no tomorrow. Yeah, the line's drawn. It's me against them and it's all at war instead of home sweet home. <laughs> When you're deep in REM sleep, do they finally come to get you? You don't stand a chance, none of us do, they're all friggin' terrorists! Welcome to the world of bedbugs. <laughs> they don't like extreme temperatures. They see, they run away from bright lights. They know the difference if you're listening to music. Or having sex. <laughs> or about to take a piss. <laughs> In France, they call them stinker. In Germany, they're known by two names. Nightcrawlers or Wallis. Nachtkrabler und der Fandelaus! Did I say that right? Nein. Oh. <laughs> It's a good language to swear in. <laughs> uh, poor Michael was doing some research and he found this about the enemy. And guess what the bedfuss did? They crawled upside down on the ceiling. <laughs> like paratroopers on the map. Spider powers! Oh. <laughs> so I trapped a bunch of bugs in a jar. Took them to a frozen river, opened the jar, and put them at the end of long sticks, which I plunged into the fucking cold water, holding on to one end. Those vermin insects had no trouble breathing underwater for five hours, with the same time walking a third of a mile. Yeah, then, <laughs> he frozen in ice for days. <laughs> he, 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 uh, he also, um, my original point. They have navigational skills. They understand gravitational and projectile mass. <laughs> and they have a whole arsenal of combat tactics, weapons, and even emergency medical aid. I tell you, they're ruthless and they're cunning, truly evil soul. So who am I? Just a single puny human being against an invisible army of these insects from hell. It's just the beginning, the beginning of the big bug apocalypse. Those bloodthirsty invading marauders and blood insomnia calling stupid bugs and shit. Denial. Look, no, I don't have bed bugs. I'm clean, you know. Second stage. Anger. Look how the hell did we get bed Bargain. Okay, if we don't have three bites in a row like in those internet 